Charles, what are your greatest challenges as service contractors? Um, actually closing the deal and mm -hmm. getting the customer to decide that you're the guy that they're going to use. Yeah, and why do you think that is? Um, people are skeptical about having people in their, in their houses. They want to make sure they have the right, right guy for the job. Yeah. What do you think that you've learned specifically this week that will improve your results? How to talk to customers, how to deal with customers and objections, um, finding out what people's needs and wants are, and, and what's most important to people that you're servicing. Is that something that you didn't used to do before then, really, so much? No. Yeah. We found out they had one problem, we'd address the one problem, or I'd address the one problem, and I'd walk out, and that would be it. All right, so I like wouldn't, wouldn't search for any more issues that, was, that were going on in the house. So you, you would turn up and you'd, you'd, to do the job, fix the thing, and then... Uh, Ask for the money and leave. All right. Not even, a, most of the time, just a thank you. Right. Hey, thanks. Great. Yeah. But instead of like, now you can look at... Oh, now I'd be able to uh, walk in there, talk to a customer, find out what the problem that they called about, and, and also find, uh, not abruptly, but nice and easily, find out some of their other needs and wants in the house. Um, Joe's a really nice guy. Uh, He's a very likable guy. Uh, uh, stern, though, he, he gets his point across. Um, make sure that you're learning what you're supposed to be learning. So he's, he's a good teacher, that's for sure. So how would you rate this training? Um, priceless. Um, it, it, it's the difference between making thirty, forty thousand dollars a year and endless. This, I would even say in my everyday life that this training has probably changed my life. Which, uh, other than the... the other than the contracting part of it. Yeah, so the, your personal life? And, I see things probably differently than I did before. Well, all in a week. So out of 10? Um, yeah, well, 10's it, 10, 10's it. Uh, if that's what you get, 1 to 10 is all you're giving me? <laughs> all right, 10. <laughs> okay, so who do you think should attend this class? Um, anybody from uh, a car salesman to anybody who sells service, um, anybody who's selling anything should, should take this class. Um, and, and maybe it doesn't seem like that would help them as much, um, but there's plenty in here that would, you, would change a car salesman's uh, approach to the way he does things, or a bike salesman, or somebody who's selling paper, so anybody that sells anything. So anything else you'd like to add? Um, thank you very much. It was really nice, uh, really nice coming down here and learning what I learned. I uh, I really appreciate it.